Hey guys, it's John and welcome back to my playthrough of The Quarry. In the last video, we actually finished the game. But in this video, I'm going to be playing the game again, except this time, I'm going to try to make sure everyone dies, or as many people as I can. I want to see heads rolling. I want to see people getting impaled. I want to see people gurgling and choking and dying and gasping for their lives. That's what I want to see, because, uh, well, the ending of the game made me a little upset. And uh, I want to get revenge. I also just want to see what's different about things. I want to see uh, what different scenarios I can get with people out of the picture. And uh, yeah, so let's go ahead and just get started. I guess we do, do we do a new game? Okay, so just in the interest of time, because this is like a nine hour playthrough and uh, I don't want to spend nine hours playing through the entire game again, because I don't think you can skip dialogue. I'm going to start in chapter three, because I don't think that you can do anything that kills you before that, in, in the first uh, two chapters in the prologue. So I'm going to start with chapter three and we're going to go through the rest of it. So uh, another thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to like fail all the QTs. I'm going to pick the rudest possible dialogue. It's going to be great. Oh, I got the tower this time, y'all. I got it this time. A lot of people were upset. They were like, oh, the tower is a tarot card. Duh. But I mean, maybe there's a, there, there's a couple towers around here. I thought maybe it was talking about that. No, you can't skip this. I'm trying to skip it and you can't. So we're just going to have to do this the long way. Let's kiss this time. <laughs> Aw, well they're gonna die, so may as well let them enjoy themselves, you know? This is what we all wanted all along. <laughs> Nick is falling for you! That's all it took?! Did you hear that? Mm -hmm. Should we look? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Wait, Nick doesn't get attacked there? Oh, wait. Oh, oh, it's gonna happen now. I think, because the thing turned and ran. Why did it run? Knowing what we know now. Is it another boar? About how the game ends. It's too girly. Why did it run away? Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, help Nick here because I wanna see if he says something different when he kills us later. Oh my God. Path chosen. Now, which werewolf is this? Is this Kaylee? And I can't help but notice that the uh, Jedediah and Bobby are shooting at the werewolf. I want to see what happens here. If we miss it, I also want to see if Abby can die before Nick kills her. Um, yeah, let's run. I'm just gonna miss the QTs. Uh-oh. Wait, where's the A button? Is it this one? No, that says Y. Oh, wait. Oh, Bobby catches us. Let me get a good look at you, girl. Let me go! If she's bit. <laughs> it's so awkward. I mean, if there was a monster, I think I'd stick with the guy with the gun. Just me. Nah, let's see what happens if we don't climb the tree. No tree climbing this time. Will you just keep running? Alright, so we end up in the same place. And I think we're gonna have the don't breathe segment. So I'm going to fail it this time and see what happens. All right. 
And I think now it's safe. What? Oh. Oh, yeah, here we go. Oh, we got bit too. Abby got bit. Can we have an ending where they're all werewolves? Actually, ooh, I was like, I think they all need to die. But I think it would be interesting if they were all werewolves. That would be cool too. Oh yeah, I saw a lot of people asking about who this is. So this is one of the hikers that disappeared. I have snacks. Sorry. Listen, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be here for a while, watching the same crap over and over again. I already watched all these scenes once when I edited the videos, so. Well, twice, actually. Once when I played it, twice when I edited the videos. Wait, what? Okay, I'll get it, I guess. I don't know. Look, you can't just pretend that it didn't happen. <gasps> oh, but I can, because you see, oh, help! Help! I'm I'm drowning and I I need a big, strong, not at all insecure man to come save me. <laughs> <laughs> ask Nick. Yeah, well, why don't you ask Nick? Okay, I'm sure he'd love to rescue you. I'm ignoring <laughs> you. Just sour puss. <laughs> oh. Oh. Gotcha. Oh, so they end up flirting anyway. Emma is getting bored of this. Oh no! Oh, okay. Emma, don't okay. get bored, please! Get See? <clears throat> I don't want this to end. I don't want this to end. <laughs> I'd be happy to stay out here all summer, but I think we'd get a little pruning. Oh, you know what I mean, like... I mean this. Jacob, I had a great summer with you. Well, it doesn't just have to be this summer. <laughs> Okay, oh, look, how about this? Um, <clears throat> if I can do a backflip off of here, you let me come visit you, okay? How about that? Right. Hey! Where are you going? Come on! that I put in my boxers for some reason. Okay, so I think we could probably kill him here, but I don't want to do that. I'm going to go help Abby. Emma! Jacob, over here! I've decided what? ever since Abby got uh, bit. It was like a, like a scream. And it, it sounded like Abby, but like not the good kind of scream. I can't hear you. Okay, look, just, just hold on. I'm going to go check it out. What? Seriously? Path updated. Okay. At least he talks to her there. Uh, yeah, so I've decided ever since Abby got bit, I thought she was gonna die. But since she got bit, it had it got me thinking, can we turn everyone into a werewolf? Because if so, that's what I want to do. Killing everybody, you know, that sounds fun. Oh, look at this song. Can I do better? <laughs> can I do better? Uh, I like how he's not sure. He's like, can I do better? I'm still in the philosophical stage. I don't know if I can do better. <laughs> what a pointless song. You're an evil genius. Why, why do we have to be involved in, in their self-improvement, you know? Nick or Abby. Anyway. Good cue. Good cue. Uh, can I please skip this? I don't know. Nick's got the beast in him. Uh, if by beast you mean he, some sort of he literally does baby deer. he literally does have the beast in him though. Hey, don't let the cute foreshadowing be aesthetic fool you. It's like a steel barbecue grill under that shirt. Go after Nick. Go. <laughs> you should do it. <laughs> maybe, maybe you should go. Look, I gotta help Abby. Go. He might be hurt too. <laughs> Caitlin is losing that respect for you. That got a hell of a spread. Be careful. If only there were some actual consequences to Caitlyn losing respect for you. But no, it's just something there to make you feel bad, I guess. Because Caitlyn and Ryan's relationship ends up going absolutely nowhere. 
Just like Ryan and Dylan, because they get separated for the entire game. And then Ryan randomly ends up with Laura instead at the end. I mean, I mean, not really like ends up with, but like he ends up spending the most screen time with Laura. Weirdly. I don't know why. Okay, I'm gonna see something real quick. I'm gonna take the shortcut. And I'm actually gonna succeed at these skill checks. Because I wanna see something. Oh. I didn't want to have to exert effort for this. I didn't want to have to try for this playthrough. Come on. Can I do better? I'd like to improve as a human being, but I'm just not there yet. Can I do better? <laughs> it's a stupid song. Sorry, can't get over it. There's so much to dissect. I got an achievement, nick of time. Okay. Some people were talking about this scene in the comments. Shout. Uh, maybe? Hey! Get the fuck off of him! Stop, stop! I'll shoot. No, you won't. You never shoot, Ryan! Yeah, I guess we won't shoot. <laughs> oh, Nick bit him. I see. Yeah. See, I didn't get that Holy in the first shit, one. Gotta get, we gotta go. Can you walk? Can you walk? Can you walk? I didn't get that in my first playthrough. And I got a lot of condescending comments when I was like questioning why you would amputate. Everybody's just like, eh, that's what you do. Duh. A lot of people in the comments were get, was so condescending about like, obviously you amputate. Obviously, obviously. There was no evidence in the game without that scene. There is no evidence that that's the right thing to do. You don't have supporting evidence. You can assume. You can assume that like, yeah, let's pause Jacob for a second. I mean, you can assume that like, oh, once you're bit, the infection spreads and you have to amputate to stop the infection, but that's an assumption. Because it's never shown. Besides that scene, it's never shown that that's the case. You, all you have to go off of is Dylan's word being like, we should amputate, dude. And that's not, sorry, but that's not how these games work. I would, you know what? There's probably a reason a lot of you guys hated Man of Medan is because you just shot first, asked questions later in that game. And then you got pissed when you got a bad ending. Probably any time a monster showed up in Man of Medan, you guys were like, they're dead! And then you were like, oh, shitty ending. Alright, how can we get Jacob bit? <laughs> Who the fuck are you? Who the fuck are you? Fuck you, you fucking asshole! <laughs> Why would you say that? Oh, Jesus Why would you Christ, say what the fuck that? Are you doing? He's so needlessly aggressive in that scene. I can't wait till uh, Ryan and Dylan are in the uh, radio station lodge, and I can make Ryan say "fuck you" <laughs> after Dylan opens the door. I can't wait for that. Oh, what are you doing? Shh, quiet. Let's let's do dirt. Distraction. Pocket sand! Damn it! Ugh. Poor Bobby, sort of. Alright, well, we just left without the blood on us. I think that's gonna make it easier for us to turn to a werewolf at some point. The tower. The tower. Mm hmm. Jump I wanna see the scene for that troubles. one. Fight or flight. That's the question we all ask ourselves, but often when leaping out of danger, we're still faced with certain peril. Watch your step. It could be your last. Okay, yeah, duly noted. Let's watch the tower. 
All right, let's see what they got. Whoa, you could miss and just fall Back to your death to as den. Emma? Back to Hackett's Quarry. Back to Hackett's Quarry you go. Oh, the fun you'll have. I don't remember her saying that. Did she say that in the first playthrough? So you can just you can just jump for the zip line and miss and fall to your death. I was wondering if she was saying something it's about that. It was we should amputate. We should cut it off before the infection spreads. What? You're an idiot. You're literally an idiot. Hey, I'm just trying to help. He just needs a doctor. Proper medical attention. And a shrine's right. Too, probably. <laughs> Dylan didn't appreciate that. Oh no. Could the absolutely no chemistry relationship suffer any worse blow than Dylan not respecting or appreciating what Ryan said? <sighs> but what about what about their budding romance? Okay, now I think you can kill Jacob here if you shoot him. It would make sense. But I'm not going to shoot him because I want him to turn into a werewolf. Ah, uh, the intense struggle. <laughs> if you don't let go, you win. What? You fucking stop! We're in a real mess here, guys. You're acting like pricks, both of you. There's a treehouse over there. I'm gonna go and see if I can't dish out some of that sweet, sweet panoramic goodness. You know, I can't help but feel like the way that Emma is portrayed here, being the influencer, right as now. this like even if I did, vapid, shallow, yeah, then I'd look like the you know, person. He was the one who, who stole I have to wonder how place. Supermassive feels about you know Sorry, I'm influencers. <laughs> Streamers, content creators, I wonder how they really feel considering they made this insufferable character be one of them. It's interesting. I'm sure it's just a character choice and there's nothing there, so but... This is like an unexcavated part of the quarry that... Oh my gosh, I'm just trying to get to the... the lake. Let's even get Emma uh -huh. bit here. I yeah, wonder how we can. Do we snoop through someone else's belongings? Or do we open the spooky trap door and die a horrible, painful death? There are literally no right answers. All right, so let's go ahead. Let's let's skip the bag. Let's open the trap door. Here we go. We won't have the taser or the bear spray, <laughs> so we should just get world. bit here, right? The final curtain is calling, and there's no time for an encore. Yep, there we go. Okay, we got bit. Okay, we're, uh... Oh, we're dying! Oh, Max is killing us! Oh, what? No! Okay, no, there's gotta be some way to get... We're gonna have to use a life here because that's not what we want. Emma died. Yeah, let's use a life. Okay. We might have to do this again. Actually, this might be tough to get everyone to be a werewolf. Because how do you make sure they get bit Take without dying? Oh oh let's use bear spray this time. Okay, that's good. All right, now how do we get bit here? Assuming that we can, we might not be able to. I don't think that we missed these yet. Max is such an awkward, clumsy werewolf. Oh. We don't want to fall here on the zip line. That's not going to get us bit. I feel like we got to get bit while we're like in the middle of like escaping. I think Max is the coolest werewolf spray, but I already have the bear spray. Well, I guess we do it again. Oh, it's not one use. Okay, well, we know that he catches up to us. So... 
I mean, I was looking forward to like failing on the QTs and stuff, but I kind of like this new mission that we have more. Okay. So here. Okay, block door. Uh, let's use trap door. Okay, so maybe maybe we don't do this. Or something. reason he's not just killing us. Okay, he took a chunk out. He took a chunk out. But then, can we get out? No. Oh my god, he ripped out our intestine. Oh my god. We're dead. He just completely disemboweled us. Oh my god. <laughs> this is gonna be hard. Okay. We are just seeing different ways that she dies, but they're not as glamorous. Okay, so we want to get this. We've still got one more life, so it's not the end of the world. Okay, let's see what happens if we mess this up. Okay, yeah. Damn. But then we want to get this, because we just got bit. Yeah. Okay, wow. Do you see her neck? Uh. Okay. So Emma's officially bit. Good. Awesome. So Emma and Abby are both bit now. And Nick. All three of them. And unbeknownst to us, Laura is too. So we got four of the main characters. And Max, so that's five of the kids. Easy. Bit. So we just need to get Ryan, Dylan, and Caitlin. Are you in pain? Those are the only ones, right? No, Ryan, Dylan, no, Caitlin, sorry. and Jacob. So we need to we need to get four more bit, and then they'll all be werewolves. I don't think Nick's injuries are as bad as we thought. We don't know that. No, it's true. Caitlin said. So all I'm saying is that we are not professionals, okay? We don't know. We He could have rabies or something. Way to be optimistic, man. I'm just being realistic. We gotta call for help. Ryan is losing call? hope. Oh, no. Uh, Mr. H? We don't want that to happen. The only number I got is to this phone. Despondent Ryan. Okay, then 911. 911. What's wrong? Dead. Yeah, okay, so this is something... Who cut the line? Because that's something that's never explained. Who cut the line to call 911? One of the Hackett's? They just happened to be around for that? Well, weird. did you hang up? How could I have hung up? I don't know. Press you know, thing. maybe you slipped and hung up or something. Do you know how phones work? Yeah, of course. Real phones, not cell phones? Do you know how phones work? Okay, well, you broke it. I did not. <sighs> Put that back, Dylan. Aggressive. You gotta be crazy. You gotta be fucking crazy if you think I'm gonna go out there without something to defend myself. It's more of a safety concern. Oh, do you think I'm gonna shoot my eye out? Or your whole head? Don't be a dick, man. I know how to use this. It's not like you do, Ryan. Okay. Uh, it's, it's probably the weather. Oh my god. What weather, So, like, Ryan? how does this happen? I guess this is Bobby. Maybe it was the bears. But he doesn't show Bear. up for like a long why time. Blame everything on bears. Okay, so for the sake of argument, so they cut. So Bobby cuts the phone line and then the power. But why? Why would he do that? The power. Just give her your gun. Keep gun or give gun. I mean, I may as well keep it. No, fuck that. I'm keeping it, dude. 
if those hunter guys come back, she's basically a sitting duck in here. You're being well. Really she's just gonna right give now. the it's them the gun, gun anyway. No, I'm just being safe. She's just I gonna give them the gun an anyway. Right now. Look, you don't tell me what to do, man. Okay, I'm sorry, but it's it's not gonna happen. What are we even? What are we even talking about? Just give her the gun. We don't need it. We already have a gun. <laughs> Fuck. Why don't you give her yours, dude? Frustrated. You finished? Are you finished berating me? I could go on, but please take your turn. <sighs> Look, I know that you're Mr. Large and in charge in a crisis, and that's great, but I finally feel like I have one piece of control over the situation, and you want me to give that up, and that's just brutal, dude. It's, it's not worth having this argument with you. Well, you started it, man. <laughs> Ryan doesn't like this side of you. Here comes Caitlin, the disappointed mom. Am I interrupting something? <laughs> this is the only time when Caitlin shows any kind of like resentment towards Dylan over Ryan. Oh my God. What happened? Jesus, where's the gun? We gotta get out. No, we have to hide. Let's run this time. Oh. I got you, girl. Oh no! Ooh. And she's got that werewolf strength! Oh, you're mine. She's mine! Oh. Hey, wait, no, we don't want to kill him, though. We want to be werewolves, but... Yeah. He doesn't know his own strength. That's cool, we got to see some of Abby's werewolf strength. I like that. Where's Caitlyn? Caitlyn just peaced out? Oh no, yeah, she's, out she's outside. Already. Not really in a position to help, I see. So, uh, how far does it go? Oh, um, well it was designed just to broadcast to the PAs around camp for announcements. And to, you know, portable radios and whatever, so... I think the range is about... a mile. I don't think it'll help. That doesn't seem like it's gonna help us much. <laughs> don't underestimate the power of technology. Uh, is technology the right word? No, yeah, you're right. This is more like magic, man. Radio oh, so is technology. <laughs> Why didn't you tell me that there's something out there? Okay, I want to see what could Ryan possibly say in here? Fuck you. Why does he say this? Fuck you. I, I I didn't know what I saw. But you saw something and you didn't think that you should fucking tell me? I forgot. I mean, the, I, the guys came on the radio. <laughs> okay, it makes more sense that he's like, oh, fuck you. Because I thought he was like, yeah. Fuck you! <laughs> I thought that's more of what uh, it was gonna be. Alright, so, Dylan's gonna get bit. We just have to not amputate. Is it a bear? To turn him into a werewolf. What now? Uh. We gotta kill it. It's not a normal animal, man. <laughs> I don't think a gun's gonna cut it. He's right. Why wouldn't it be? Of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? I don't know, man. I just don't think it's a good idea to go running out guns blazing against some random ass super animal. Well, what the hell else can we do? Well, if it's got. So we go hearing, with like his idea dog, no matter what. Maybe? Okay. Uh, I mean, we could. We could play a really high-pitched feedback loop and crank it to the max and I mean it would hurt like hell but okay fine let's do it feedback thing All right. so how does this happen they don't show it
Like, how did it bite? No way. No way, man. I'm not dismembering you. Path chosen. Look how calm he is suddenly. <laughs> You're turning into a werewolf, Dylan. The wire, the wire. Get the wire. Get the wire. What? The wire. We gotta plug it in the thingy. On it. Oh, interesting how Ryan doesn't get bit here. What do I do? What do I do? The button, the button. All right, well, he still got his hand, so. Okay, we should start seeing some major differences and some major departures here oh, um, after this. Because now everybody's infected except for uh, Ryan, Jacob, going. and <laughs> Caitlin. We still gotta get those and then we're, and then we're good. All right, let's see if there's a way that we can get Jacob bit here. By the way, I am ignoring all the evidence, so even though there's a, there's a memory card over there, I'm just ignoring all of it. Oh, I forgot about this. Oh, God, Emma! Ah, Jesus Christ! I wonder if there's a difference. Oh. Oh, oh. oh fuck. My. Life. Okay, you scared me. Jacob. Okay. I guess you could call it that. That fucking thing bit me, dude. <gasps> really need Caitlyn to look in it. I... Yeah. Wait, it bit you? That little scratch? Oh. Oh. I, uh... Could have sworn it was much bigger before. Oh, is she's healing. She's regenerating. Werewolf regeneration. Okay, we've got to get out of these woods. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. You know, Jacob, you don't have to be a dick about literally everything. <laughs> okay, so we're back. It's bottlenecked again. Um, shit, sorry. Shit. Okay, you know what? You're right, okay? You're right. I'm sorry. Oh, you're so annoying. Oh my god, can we please not do this right now? Okay, seriously? <laughs> I literally came looking for you as soon as I heard there was something uh... out here. Or things, like plural. Wait, really? <sighs> mm -hmm. There's about to be a lot more of them. I'm propagating the werewolf kingdom. Okay, now how do I get bit but not die? Okay, wait, Emma's running with me this time. That's not what happened last time. Emma's not, Emma wasn't running with me. Okay. Well, this is different. Sorry. Okay. Hide. May we hide and we mess up the don't breathe. Or maybe I missed it there. Oh, that's not gonna work, you idiot. Okay, this worked last time with Abby, so. Yes! Yes, we got bit! We got bit! Uh. Okay, that was awkward. But we got Jacob bit! Yes! The only people that aren't bit are Caitlyn and Ryan. How am I gonna get Caitlyn bit? We, Because Ryan ends up getting bit anyway, so we just do that again. We just have Laura bite him again. But then how do we get... Is she like one of those Brian bit? All right, Abby. let's see if Nick's aggro with me because it said yeah. Nick is falling for you earlier. Can I ask you something? Of course. Is it just gonna be the same scene? Do you like me? Uh. Nick. See, I've been I've been picking Please all the good choices. Tell me. And I kissed him in the woods and stuff. 
Because I wanted to see I if it would change the dynamic I here. Enjoyed spending time with you this summer. It's such, oh, such, it's such, what? It's such a cop out answer. Yeah, it's it's the same. No matter what you do. Abby. I mean, I guess it uh, makes what? sense, sort of. But it makes me wonder why there was even those choices to begin yeah. with. Okay. Because it seems like the payoff... You like me, Abby? Yeah, it seems like the payoff is the same. Nick, I do like you. No, you don't, you don't like me at all, do you? What do yeah. you mean? Nick doesn't believe you. I am telling but you the why truth. why wouldn't he believe me? God. <laughs> This might be like one of my favorite scenes in the game. So I wonder if, since I'm already bitten, I wonder if he still attacks me. Or if I do have to shoot him. I'm gonna try to not shoot him again and see what happens. Does he still transform and kill me? Kills you, all right. Okay. Interesting. Okay, I guess we'll shoot him this time. I just wanted to see. <laughs> that's a, that's so good. That's so good. Okay, this is our last life. So. Ooh. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Uh, maybe I, I might need the life later. I know that we've only got two more to turn, and one of them I already know how to, Ryan. So it's really just Caitlyn. We just need to get Caitlyn. So I assume this doesn't kill him. I, I hate that she drops it immediately after he falls to the ground. Abby's alive now. Cool. Well, that'll be one major difference. I mean, aside from everybody being werewolves. Well, yeah, out of extra lives. It's too bad that Emma's segment is so ruthless. Because, like... I used to... Try, just trying to get her bit instead of killed. It's really easy to get her killed up there on the island. Instead of just bit, so... So the thing that I'm looking forward to right now, trying to figure out, and the reason why I wanted to see if he would still attack Abby earlier is because I don't know how I'm going to get through to the end with everyone being werewolves. If I get to the part where Ryan kills Chris, he's got the gun trained on him. If I choose not to kill Chris, I wanted to see if he would spare me, because I'm also a werewolf, because, like, Abby's been bitten, and, uh, you know, Nick's a werewolf, but he still killed her. So then I don't know how I'm going to get through this without killing Chris. I want to see if you can spare Chris, because if we kill Chris, then it's going to undo the werewolfness of everyone, and I don't want that to happen. So I want everyone to stay werewolves through the, to the end if I can. Ah. 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 Hey, stop. Stop squirming. Okay, I wonder if she... Is he gonna notice that she's bit? I don't think he is. I don't know. 
Let me look at her. Nah. Yeah. Get the fuck away from me! Because it's completely healed now. Interesting. So that doesn't change. All right. So Emma's back in the car. So this is another thing is, you know, later when Dylan and Caitlin come across Emma in the car, I wonder if she'll have transformed by then. Huh, this might be more complicated than I thought to keep everyone alive but transformed. Oh, Abby! I killed him. I killed him. No, you didn't. Oh, she thinks that. I mean, dead people don't usually jump out of windows and run into the forest. Yeah. Anxious. I just don't get it. You did what you had to do. Abby, he was gonna hurt you. You were defending yourself. I, I don't... I don't know that for sure. I do. <laughs> no. It was you or him. And, well, that definitely wasn't him. Man, this is so fucked. Hey! Okay, no, but here's, oh, here's Laura. Okay. Where the fuck is Chris Hackett? Why don't we take another look at what you've found? I haven't found anything. Sorry. Did you look hard enough? These cards aren't just trinkets. You should know this by now. They they <laughs> can help you. I can help you. Off you go then. Top top. One down, remember. It's not terribly exciting. I'm wondering what I should do with the hackets. Kaylee dies no matter what. I wonder if there's a way to spare the other Hackett's. But like, if I spare Chris, that probably means that Bobby dies. So, so uh... Eh. Why? Name. Eat. Shit. <laughs> when I say name, you give me your name. Do I make myself clear? You've got my license, can't you read? Ooh. I am an officer of the law. I need you to do as you're told and answer the goddamned questions. Well, it doesn't make a difference, though. I don't care what you are. You can't hold us like this. This isn't legal. I want a lawyer. Stop! You need to Stop. shut your mouth and listen to me or there is going to be a problem. Do we have a problem? Sheriff's badge doesn't mean a lot. Guess that sheriff's badge doesn't mean a whole lot if you don't believe in the law. Oh. Excuse me? <laughs> we didn't do anything. You locked us up. Explain that to me. Lady, I don't think you have any idea what kind of shit you just stepped into. There is shit, and then there's shit. Great line. Stop fucking around. You just stop fucking around with me and tell me what the fuck is going on! What the hell attacked us last night and why did you arrest us, you goddamn maniac! Take me to Max! Break now! Yeah, the same thing happens uh, regardless if you're compliant or angry. I'm gonna try lashing out. Here we go. <laughs> the cop doesn't Don't like you. Try that shit with me. He doesn't like me anyway. He doesn't like you either way. Hey. He does not like green heads, eggs and ham. Hey, you asshole. I like Max's little shuffle there. Did I say you could talk to each other? Don't need your permission. I wasn't aware we needed your permission, Detective Dick Whippet. <laughs> yeah, it's a free country, Officer Oat. For brains. Shit. <laughs> nice try, Max. <laughs> uh. 
I mean, I'm pretty sure the same thing is gonna happen regardless. I'm gonna be upset if I'm wrong. Hands through the bars. Your turn. Let's hey, go. hands through the bars, buddy. We can talk right here. Let's go. Come on. Your turn. Hey. Come hey. on. <laughs> leave him hey, alone. Leave him alone. Yeah, leave me alone, asshole. Both of you shut up. Fuck you. I said shut up. Hey, you can't treat us like this! You're hurting it! Hey! Oh. Oh, I got I got a tarot card underneath the, the bed. Oh what? How do you how did you even get that? Oh, I was hoping I could go back and not have a tarot card, but I also haven't seen this one, so whatever. <laughs> Ryan, right? Yeah. Shut the fuck up. You let her finish, <laughs> man. <laughs> I love it. Just wrapping things up here. Okay, I'm not gonna call for help this time, but nothing's gonna change. Down I don't to think. twenty. Over. What's gonna happen? Well, I'll tell you. It's not gonna be pretty. But don't worry. I'll be back at dawn. You're really gonna leave me here? You'll be fine. Just don't get too close. Okay, so slightly different. He's not quite as mean, but that's about it. Oh, chapter seven's so long. Oh, it's so long. Come closer, let me see your eyes. I think I better stay back. Max, I need to observe you. Fucking close enough for you, bitch! Whoa! Wow! He had a personality shift just like Nick. We hadn't seen that before. Why'd you think, Chris? Jesus, Travis. You're still here. That's fucked up. What the fuck What am I supposed to do? What was that? Oops. The cutie. The cutie doesn't do anything. Uh, Ooh, I guess you miss out on uh, eavesdropping Travis some things. Was just in the hall talking, the cop. Wait, so how come Max didn't kill you? Then? Let's show the bite this time. He tried. I got away. I need to end this. Okay. <laughs> we don't have much time. So right here. Let's make Laura respect me. Or uh Wait, what? Oh, okay. I guess we'll come back to that. Let me go. All right? <laughs> Let me go. Or I'll call the fucking cops. <laughs> Why are you laughing? <laughs> Travis is the cop. <laughs> oh, oh my god. Chapter 7 is finally over. You. Poking oh your nose my god. where it doesn't belong. That chapter is so long. Everything you hear. And you can't skip anything. Anyway. Oh. Anyway. Here we are again. I did Let's get a new tarot card. I want to see what it is. The world. Ah, the world. <laughs> Often travelers' paths are direct, but sometimes it is not so simple. Sometimes they're intertwined with others. Compassion over anger. You will need friends where you're going. It's not until we fall into the belly of the beast that we realize how perilous things can be. And the same question as always. Will you let me show you more? Yes, I would like to see more. Please, please, what does this one hold for us? Well, okay, he's arguing with Laura. And then what happens? Ow, well that happens no matter what! You'll be seeing me a few more times before- That happens no matter what! 
Come on. I look forward to that. As long as you follow the right path, of course. I think you'll be pleased with what ends up happening. Because I don't plan on killing Silas at the end, obviously. Um, I don't know about the Hackets. They might have to all die. They might have to die. Okay, let's be commanding. I said shut I said, up. shut up. You've done enough talking. Okay, so you talk. Say what you gotta say. You, Ryan, maybe this is a bit much. I mean, just think about everything that's happened tonight. All this over a poem? I'm not letting her kill Chris. No way, not, not over some old-timey poem. It's not just the poem, though. Oh, it's Abby. everything. The kidnapping, Where has two she months been? locked up, her, her boyfriend bursting into a thing. Like what happened to Nick. The longer we sit around questioning her motives, the longer Nick is out there. Jacob, Emma, we're all in danger. I believe her. This is what Shut she has up, to do. Shut up, Abby. Ooh. Don't move. Well, this is different. Your I like wrist. this. Stay away from her, I'll shoot. It's silver, right? Uh, yeah. May I? Wait. What are you doing? What are you doing? I'm trying to help. Worst a case wrist? scenario, oh. this should give you a fighting chance. And this will kill them? For good? Yeah. She's putting it in a shotgun shell. But what if it's Nick or someone? Like I said, worst case scenario. Well, we won't be using it. Okay. But thanks. Quine, put that fucking thing down before you hurt someone. <laughs> Alright, Ryan, you got a new girlfriend now. So, come on. Now she takes the gun Where no matter Chris what. Where live? When he's not at camp, I mean. Alright. I'm going with you. What? what? Uh, yeah, what they said. I'm gonna show you that Chris Hackett has nothing to do with this. He wanted us to stay inside tonight. He wanted us safe. I don't care what you think. I don't care what you think. <laughs> Shut up. Fine. <laughs> Do whatever you want. That's so weird. You saw what Shut, up. To me. Shut up. Shut up. No, you shut up. Oh my gosh. Where is Abby right now? Be fine. That cop car you stole. Where, Where is, is it? Abby just like it's shows like, up why? for a second and then it she leaves again. Car. What is wrong with you? I've had kind of a fucked up summer. Yeah, well, doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Oh my god. What's that supposed to mean? Oh, she doesn't I, even know. You're still alive, I guess. Nobody else needs to get hurt. An eye for an eye makes the whole world blind. No offense. I'm not doing this for revenge. I need to save Max. You're doing all of this for a boy? <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Just leave him like this? I owe it to him. Like I said, kind of a fucked up summer. Nice, yeah. Well, we all understand. Right, Ryan? No. Hey, uh, Mr. Rach has nothing to do with that. So, I can I say how disappointed I am that I have seen no there one transform yet? I'm starting to think it's not going to happen, but so it has to. Will you stop protecting him? Whose side are you on? At this point, I have no fucking idea. There is a lot more to this than you realize. Like what? Kidnapping, murder, cover-ups. I think the whole goddamn Hackett family is in on it. Maybe the whole camp, maybe even you, for all I know. Yeah, great. Ryan just is out of his away. depth. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I just figured that instead of standing around listening to you complain, I'd actually try to find another way across. Yeah, let's both stand on this thing. Oh, no. So what's your deal, then? What do you mean? The whole mysterious brooding loner thing. It doesn't quite fit with the I love my camp leader vibe. So I don't fit into the right box. Is that what you're saying? 
You know that's not what I mean. I've been coming here for years. You get to know a place and it feels like a second home, you know? I mean, until now. What about your friend, uh, Caitlin? Is that her name? It seems like she looks up to you. Mm-hmm. I guess, uh, I'm, I'm kind of closer to Dylan, though. What? After tonight, uh, I don't know. Well, trauma Even after bring people together. Yeah, and vodka. Well, so what about you? Who I guess you I did make them like kiss more. I don't know. Maybe neither. I see. <laughs> so weird. This way, I see a light. Yeah. I have no idea why they decided hang out here? To, to make Ryan and Laura the dynamic duo. Let's see what happens if we fail this. Oh, it doesn't matter. Thanks for your help. You had it whether, control. Whether or not you do that QTE, it doesn't matter. She just take, tears it off anyway. Let's not get it. I want her to chastise me. For not bringing in uh, tarot cards. Yeah, I, the, the whole fact that like Ryan and Laura have more screen Honestly? time together than Ryan and Caitlin ever get. And arguably more than Ryan and Dylan? I'm not sure. I mean, they get they get two entire chapters. Three, really. I think this is it. Oh, this will be interesting. So we're meeting back up with Emma, and then she's- we're not gonna tell her that Abby's dead, because Abby's still alive. Ab actually, is Abby with us? Oh, <gasps> It's Caitlin, Dylan, and Abby this time, okay. So this is different, we get to see what happens. I think we'll have to turn Caitlin at the- at the junkyard. Uh, what the hell happened here? I guess we'll just fail a QT or something and she'll get bit, hopefully. Wait, what? Uh, that's kind of my bad. Had a bit of a tumble with one of the locals. The fuck, Caitlin, this place is wrecked. <laughs> well, you should see the other guy. What do you think happened to Jacob and Emma? Probably nothing, hopefully. I mean, I mean should we go find them? Warn them? I think the safest thing, the most responsible thing, is to try and get help. Right. And then we can come back for them. And Nick. And Nick. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, okay, here we go. Wait. We get to see what? Abby and Emma reunited. Is there, is there something in there? I don't know. What is it? I... Jacob? She might, she might be a werewolf Emma? this time. Are they, should I open it up? Your funeral, buddy. <laughs> okay, wait, I'm ready. Run, shoot, shoot, I guess. Now we don't have silver shells, we just have regular ones, right? So. Oh, oh gosh. <laughs> Bring it on, asshole. Get inside, you idiots! How many shells do you have? Emma's not a very good werewolf. She's not very good at this. Abby, what are you doing? Caitlin, the silver. Use the silver shell. Wait. What if it's Nick? What if it isn't? Oh, but then we have to kill Emma. Regular shot, regular shot. I don't want to kill Emma. Whoa. Go inside, you idiots! 
Okay, good. Good, I didn't want to kill her. I want them all alive. I want them all alive and cursed. I'm glad it's possible so far. What about Abby? She'll be safer in the storm shelter. We don't all have to go. Agreed. Hmm. I like how she came. I like how Abby came back Abby, out. We're going to the scrapyard to try to find anything that can help us get the hell out of here. Uh, okay, are you sure? It's fine. You stay here. You're safe in the storm shelter. You be careful. We will. I like how Abby came out suddenly to just be like, <laughs> with her little silver shell. Go along, Caitlin. This is funny. Okay, so now we're back here. Great. Now I gotta figure out, here's what I want. And I've been thinking about this the whole playthrough. Remember in, uh, I think it was the last video, when um, was that? Eliza what? saw the Empress card, was there that? was Constance getting oh, killed by a werewolf. We got guests downstairs. So, we don't want any more blood on our hands. So that means that if we fail the QT with the gun, then we don't blow her face off. She can get killed by the werewolves, which would be really cool. I don't think that Laura will die if we do that. But I don't have any extra lives to find out. So I will see. We'll see what happens. All the emperors over here. Ah! I didn't get it. I pressed A too late. I'm gonna I'm gonna slip here, because it'll be funny. Oh, what a klutz. What a klutz, Ryan. I'm not gonna open the cage hey. this time. Danger, electricity. I like how they have that sign up. It are the Hackett's expecting anyone else other than them to come in here? You gotta get me out of here, man. How? Seriously. It's electrified. Okay, um, there's a box. Oh, let's leave Jacob. You better wah, wah, wah. Wah, wah. What? I'm sorry, man. No, 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 no dude, come on. We'll come back for you. Shut the fuck you out, Ryan. Please, Ryan, please, dude. Okay, you don't know what they'll do to me. Come on. You gotta let me out. You can't let me down here. Ooh, Pat Tosa. Fuck! Jesus Christ! When it, Jacob doesn't like you! <laughs> Who gives a shit? What's it gonna matter? I don't want to have to do the puzzle. Hopefully, you've brought me some more of my cards. Let's have a look, shall uh, we? Uh-oh. Uh, uh, about that. No, um, not one? There isn't much of the night left. Everything that happens has a consequence. You've not much more time to bring me cards. Don't waste your chance. It's funny. Go. You've still got time. Be careful now. Be very careful. Yeah, this is, um... We've got to do this right. We've got to do this right. Now, this is probably going to be the toughest part of this playthrough. Oh, we gotta do the junkyard part first. The scrapyard? Nah. Oh. Just seen the sign on my way to camp. So, Ryan and Laura, huh? Oh boy. Do you think there was something going on there? <sighs> yeah, there were definitely sparks flying there. Yeah, I know, but I couldn't tell what? if it was angry sparks or like... Sexy sparks. Definitely felt like sexy sparks. Doesn't she already have a boyfriend? Yeah, but Ryan's Ryan. What is that supposed to mean? Not that it matters. Now that he's off on a daring adventure with Little Miss Mysterious, how do you compete with that? That's different dialogue. That's different. This is like, they didn't say that before. Huh. I wonder if it's because I said all, like, the aggressive options with, uh, Dylan. Interesting. Honestly, I don't know if he's worth the effort. I call bullshit. Excuse me? You're in it, dude. You've got feelings. Ryan's just gonna go wherever the wind blows him. Wouldn't be the first dude to go where he's getting blown. Ah, ha, ha. Wouldn't really matter anyway. It looks like we finally know Ryan's type. Confident. Caitlin doesn't believe you. Heroic. With an eye patch. So pirates. Maybe she shivers his timbers. 
there. But I don't understand. They're like, sparks were flying. I don't know. I didn't really get that. It seemed like they were just squabbling. Squabbling doesn't mean flirting. Oh, shit. Relax. It's a motion sensor. We're okay. If squabbling means okay. flirting, then I'm flirting with everyone oh, look, all the back. time. Put me down. Oh, here we go. Easy, ma. Put me here down, we go. you old witch. Blow your fucking head off. Yeah, you, yeah. She <laughs> really well. But not this time. I'm going to try and see Everybody what happens. Just relax. Can't shoot, but you can't see, darling. This is such a stupid little trick. Why doesn't she just back up and let the window illuminate in front of her? Instead, she just... Gotcha. Okay, okay so I don't think she's going to blow my head off with that. I think she's just trying to disarm me. did to my Kaylee. But... You ain't hurting us anymore. You are done. Everybody stop! She doesn't even take it. She doesn't even take the gun. Murderous bitch. Ma, shut the fuck up! That ain't no way to be talking to your mother. Yes, sir. Hmm. Okay. Put me down, asshole! What the hell is going on up here? We ain't keeping them safe anymore, Bobby. Not after what they did to our Kaylee. And there's no way to save Kaylee. Why'd you put the gun down? Run, distract, run, I think. So she loses the gun no matter what. She puts the gun down no matter what. Interesting how Jedediah decides to shoot us. So all this happens no matter if Constance dies or not. Wait, isn't Constance still in the room? I don't know. I don't know. Why, why does he have to get in the dumbwaiter? Fuck. Okay, I guess we'll keep the knife in this time and see what changes. Okay. All right, that's not good. Now, before I took it out, because I thought he would keep it. I thought he would keep the knife. And I also didn't want... I, I also thought he would be, like, yeah, too not. hobbled. Walking oh. around with a knife oh. in him. Oh. You know? Wouldn't it be, like, poking shit in there? I know that it's keeping him from bleeding, but... Just saying. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's just go straight here. Look through the thing. Okay, I'm just gonna hide in the same place that I did last time. Uh, like he he goes after us no matter what, but I don't want to accidentally kill Ryan before he turns into a werewolf. That would be that would be bad. Oh wait, he just automatically hides under the bed. That's not what I wanted. Oh, it's because I didn't look in the closet. Oh, God. That's what I get for trying to speed run it, I guess. But doesn't he look under the bed here? Oh, okay, so, so it doesn't matter. There is so much space into that bed, by the way. Damn, good thing when he was coming out, he didn't, like, nudge the handle with the bed frame. That would, that would I'm really close. hurt. Stand by. You can't hide from me in my own house, fucker! You're a fucker. I love that. This is so dumb. Get her, uh -uh. Get her, Ooh, constant shrieking in the background. It enhances the experience. What I'm hoping is that when we get into the room with Chris, we can just have Chris kill everyone. When we choose not to kill him, you know? Oh, Hackett Family Tree. I didn't find this before. Hmm. 
Okay. Right. Well, can I, wait, can I look at this again? Okay, so down here... Okay, this actually tells us exactly what we were wondering about. So Constance and Jedediah, right? And then, let's see, Chris, Travis, and Robert. Okay, yeah. Bobby. Amelia Grant Hackett. Oh, we haven't met Amelia. Yeah, where where's Chris's wife? Oh, she died. It says so right there, 1999. Oh, that's the year that Kaylee was born. So probably during childbirth. I see. Anyway, does it... Look at this. There's a little legend there. Birth, death, and marriage. I see. All the way back to the 1600s, the original ones were named Jedediah and Tempest. I see. Interesting. Wow, somebody got busy over here. How many kids? Is this seven kids? Seven kids and only one of them got married? Or what? Okay, well maybe some of them got married, but they're just not in the family tree because they're not relevant, I guess. And what is this? These cages should hold Chris, Caleb, and Kaylee. Oh, the electrified cages. Yeah, but, well, hang on. Okay, because I was wondering about this. You know the electrified cages that they have Nick and um, Jacob in right now? I was like, why don't they just put Chris, Caleb, and Kaylee in there? But apparently that was the plan. When camp's over, they can keep hunting the white wolf. He's got to come back sooner or later. It'll be safe if we use blood. Last thing we need is more casualties. This actually answers the question I had, because I was like, there have been two full moons since the camp started. What'd they do for the first one? They put Chris, Caleb, and Kaylee in the cages. But then they that means that they still had Silas running around while they had summer camp going. And that's never been a problem for six years, really? But then they didn't put Chris, Caleb, and Kaylee in them tonight, clearly. Why? I guess because it says when camp's over, they can keep hunting the white, white wolf. So wait. Were, were, were they under the impression that Chris, Kaylee, and Caleb were out hunting Silas? Like, that's what they're doing? That's what they think they're doing right now? Whatever. <laughs> I mean... Yeah, not getting that. that. If that makes sense to you. But it doesn't work for me. Oh, Constance is here this time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We ain't playing games no more, little girl. Try me, motherfucker. Careful, Jet. She looks awful. Ah, oh, she's been bit. Hmm. You know something? I ain't got enough silver to kill you, but I sure to hell can make you suffer. This makes more sense if Constance is dead. To me. <laughs> Werewolf strength, bitch. <laughs> She's just standing there. Where went all that hair pulling strength from earlier? Attack or run? run. Filthy animal! Get up! Come on, you get up! What are you saying? Okay, what's your position? What's your position? Don't let her run, Jed. Cut her down. See, run doesn't actually work though. Both times that I did it. She just stands there. Oh. Uh oh. I forgot. So you're telling me that Nick spares Jacob because Jacob's infected, but he doesn't spare Abby. 
She can see in the dark. She's one of them. What are you? I'm gonna enjoy watching you die, girl. <laughs> hey! Everybody fucking stop right now! I'm gonna feel bad when Travis dies. We're setting Take up for the climactic off, scene. She's bit. Yeah. Yeah, fill her with silver, son. Wait! But even though, I thought I said earlier, the sheriff doesn't like you. Oh, poor Travis. Oh, that's too bad. <laughs> Okay, let's see if we can get Ryan out of here. Oh wait, I probably should have taken the knife out because then he'll be bleeding out and Laura will have to fight him. I didn't think about that. Oh, come on, man. You gotta help me. I do? Yeah, I promise. I won't tell anyone anything. No, man. Family first. Besides, I'll get in trouble. Stab. <laughs> Ow! You stabbed me! Yeah, like right in the hurts, nipple. Don't it? I ain't <laughs> never been stabbed before. <sighs> Leave me alone. <sighs> Ow, it really hurts. Dad! Oh, poor Bobby. Poor Bobby. I feel bad. <sighs> oh! <laughs> hey, hey, hey! It's me! It's me! Uh, she didn't, uh... What the fuck happened to you? She didn't have to scare oh, off Bobby you know, this time. Nothing out of the ordinary. He's lost a lot of blood. Yeah, okay. It's it'll, gonna happen. It'll heal though, right? Alright, yeah, we've already seen this, but Ryan's gonna become a werewolf now. Okay, okay, okay we've okay, got okay. eight down, one to go. We just need to get Caitlyn to transform now, and I think it has to happen at the junkyard. That's the only time that I think it's you gonna happen. I was... To feel better. Soon. If it's if not then then maybe with Caleb in the lodge I that's the only other time I can think that maybe it'll happen we'll see. Ooh, ooh, right here! Look, his eyes are yellow. Sure, yeah, sure thing. Um, just uh, watch my back. Yeah. Wait. Yeah. Wait, if Dylan transforms while he's in the crane... Oh no. Oh, we might not be able to make Caitlyn a werewolf. Okay, Dylan hasn't transformed yet, which is good. Let's warn Caitlyn, actually. Sam Carr. Okay. Ow, by the way. Ow. Okay, what happens? What happens if we don't drop it here? Okay, I'm gonna see what happens. I hope she doesn't die. I got an achievement. I might have done it. Oh, and it drops anyway. She's bad. We did it. We did it. They're all werewolves. Oh my god, I've been at this all day. This game is so long to replay because you can't skip anything. I've been doing this all day. Oh my god, they finally. Yes! Dylan? Uh oh. Wait. Uh. 
Oh, can we please see him transform? That's like what I was doing this for. Oh, here we go. It's finally gonna start paying off. I'm not leaving you. Fuck off. Dylan? I'm you have to fuck off. No, no, but- Go, go! <laughs> Fucking run! Run away, Caleb! Get away from me! <laughs> oh, that's kind of cheating. Oh, man. That's kind of cheating, but okay. Cool. Oh, and, and then now Abby. I haven't gotten to see this. We saw this with um, Emma earlier. You should go be a counselor at summer camp, Abby. You'll learn how to interact with people better, and you'll have loads of fun and make friends for life. Didn't Emma do the same thing <sighs> in so this sick. shelter? People telling me. Now, Abby got bit before a lot of these Do other characters. Now. And she's not showing any symptoms, which is kind of annoying. Hello? Is anyone there? I guess not. I guess not. Let's see what she has to say about this. She's got all new comments, so, you know. Mesmerizing reactions. Yes, thank you. Exhaustive analysis of the situation. Okay, we won't get that one. Ooh. That's weird. Right? I don't think that happened to Emma. Alright. Okay, those are- that's how we get the silver shells, but what if we just- Skip that, because we're not going to need the silver, silver shells, because we're not going to be killing the werewolves. Huh. Trapped I want as many people to be werewolves as possible. <laughs> all the non-werewolves I want to die, and all of the people that are currently werewolves must live. That's my policy. I'm gonna see if I can do it. I don't understand what the point of that step is. Because if you step on it as Dylan earlier, going through the trap door... I mean, it, it breaks there when you go up, but like, we didn't need it anyway. So I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, here's what we want. This is- this is what it's all been building towards. Look, there he is. He's right over here. So why- isn't he in the cage right now? Watch your step. Yep. It's weird, right? Like, he decided to chain himself up here, but he- he breaks the chains almost immediately. Yeah, look how easy that was. Good thing the floor collapses. Alright, I'm gonna sit up now. I'm sitting up in my chair. I'm ready for werewolf carnage! Werewolf carnage, let's go! Okay. Oh look, all the hackets are in here. Let's see if it pays off. There we go. Sorry, Travis, but you gotta die. Oh, oh but he's got the mirror. Oh, I forgot. Oh! 
Oh! Bobby died. I guess it's because I stabbed him with the knife. Oh! Oh! Yeah! Yeah! No, no! <laughs> no, no! Oh, Chris is just killing all of them. Oh my god! Okay, I can't shoot him. I can't shoot him. Because... Nope. Not doing it. Oh, he kills Ryan. Oh wait, no, this isn't what I wanted. Oh yes! He knocks Travis's hat off! But then she, but then, I got an achievement, mutually assured. So Laura and Travis kill each other. Oh, damn. Well, Welcome back, my friend. It was I'm a werewolf so carnage for sure. Back, especially now that more vermin have been stamped out. A few stragglers remain, but there's still time. So, then, what more has been found? Shall we take a look? That was your <laughs> last chance. I can't help you anymore. Oh, she's You're so disappointed. On your own. Okay, where'd you get that match from? Why, why pull it out? Why so theatrical? Okay, well, so everyone in that scene died except for Chris. Chris is, that's the only way that Chris can live, I guess, is if, you, you can't have everyone live, I don't think. Well, maybe, if, okay, if you don't, if you don't stab Bobby, then Bobby holds off Chris. Okay, nice. But then, Hopefully they realize they how... can't close and try the motel up the road. <gasps> yeah, I don't know. Oh, Caitlin's by herself here. Okay. Okay, Caitlin. The rain's been off and on all night. These fuckers know you're in here. They're coming back first chance they get. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Um. Okay. I need to get to a vantage point. Hopefully, transform into a werewolf. I'd love to see Caitlyn transform into a werewolf. That would be sick. Well, I was hoping everyone could live and be a werewolf, but I guess maybe I need to make slightly different choices. But still, that last scene was badass, though. Everyone died. Which is kind of what I wanted anyway at the start of the... at the start of the playthrough. You can't go up these stairs? Oh no, you can. Because I never went up here my first playthrough, so I just want to go up here real quick. Check it out. Like, maybe there's something up here. God, it's so dark. The High Priestess. I want to get... Oh. You have to get it so fast. Ah. Okay, I decided to get that one. But she said it was... It was her last chance to help me. So then what is the High Priestess for? I guess she's gonna tell me what the tarot card was at the end. I don't know. Like after chapter 10's over? It must be, right? Okay. Well, that's all that was up here. I'm glad I got it. I just can't imagine what it would show. What would it show? Rip Ian. Poor Ian. Some camp mascot to kick it before camp starts. Well, we finally find out. Sounds about right. We finally found out who Ian is. Wait. Because the caller said Ian. We hardly knew you. Yeah. And we found a caller that said Ian in the basement. Because they say Rip Ian. So I guess Chris ate the sheep. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I don't know. That's a weird one. What's this? Where have I seen this emblem before? Was it the Hackett family emblem or something? Yeah, that's what that is. It's like a Hackett family ring or something like that. And then 
I remember Mr. H's cheesy ass announcements. Whoa. Busted. Nice. Okay. Now, the only people that we've seen. Oh, what's this? What's this? That's what I just said. Hoping you could tell me. Trail You're there. Footage. It's like they're looking for something. Have you pieced it together, Caitlin? Oh no, I didn't want to collect any evidence. No. Silverbacked mirror? Eh, eh. Well, we're not going to be killing anybody else. So the only werewolves we haven't seen transform were... Well, we didn't see Ryan transform, unfortunately. Killed before he was able to. Ugh. That would have been cool. Um, and we haven't seen Jacob or Caitlyn transform, but we've seen everyone else, I think. Yeah. How long has this guy been here? I guess this is what you have to do to... Prepare for attack, yeah. Okay, now, but is he not gonna attack me, though? But Chris attacked Ryan, and Ryan was infected. I don't understand the rules. Because Nick attacks Abby, but not Jacob. Is it like they're, the infection has to be far enough along? Maybe? I don't know. Or maybe it's just whatever the plot dictates, you know? Showtime, motherfuckers. Whoever has plot armor and whoever does not. Oh. Transform. Transform. Come on, Jacob. Look at yeah, he, He's looking rough. He's looking rough. He's not he's not crying this time though. Oh, oh wow, wow, okay. No, oh, summer's over. Summer's over. And you're nothing. She doesn't want you. Nobody does. Nobody wants you. Nice. I like how all the werewolves look slightly different. They don't all look the same. Oh, okay. So he's just gonna be staying there, waving his head back and forth. He's not even gonna like run off. Come on. Keep it together. Not long till morning. Let's see you transform. Let's see you transform. Why aren't her eyes yellow? Come on. What the? There we go. Caitlin's got yellow eyes. So I guess they have to have like yellow eyes and shit first. Before they'll they'll be spared. <sighs> okay, let's wait. Let's wait and see what they do. Because if my theory is right, then we may not be able to- or we may not have to do anything. Oh! Oh! Here we go! Look, he's sniffing us. And he's like, no, not this one. Yeah! Caitlin Werewolf. No? I guess she has to have a little existential crisis first. Oh, wait, what? What, so Abby just like hangs out in the footage room? It's been an interesting night, wouldn't you agree? The cycle continues, for some at least. I have to admit, you've disappointed me. But what, I didn't kill all the hackers? Not as much as you could have done. We're bonded now, you and I. 
And though the full moon will come again and the curse remains, this night is over. Don't worry. Oh. I'll never forget what you did here. But don't you dare ever step foot in Hackett's quarry again. If I see you poking your nose where it doesn't belong, I will never stop haunting you. Wherever you go, I'll be right behind you. The breath on your neck, always just out of sight. If you ever come back, I will haunt you until the day you die. Don't worry, I'm not coming back. This is it for me. I'm not doing any more of this. This took so long to get through. Are we seriously? Okay. I'm gonna put the cam down so we can read their their things, so. Hope you understand. Oh no, Ryan was killed by Werewolf Chris, the camp leader he once looked up to. We could probably change that, I don't know. Laura and Travis reached a bloody end at each other's hands. Deceased. Ah, that's too bad. Travis, deceased. Yep. Took his head off. Took his whole head off. Bobby, deceased. Bolly was mauled to death by his werewolf brother. Is it gonna show, uh... Yeah, Jedediah was massacred by his werewolf son, Chris. <laughs> Constance was killed by her son, Chris, in werewolf form. Nice. This- this song really does not fit! I can't emphasize that enough. This song does not fit. Jacob, still infected. Despite escaping the Hackett's basement and surviving the night, Jacob's werewolf curse remains! Emma, still infected, she survived the night, but Mal now must live with the werewolf curse! Chris, still infected! Spared by Ryan at the Hackett house, Chris must now face the consequences of his rampage. Dylan, still infected. He survived the night, but now must live with the curse. Nick, yeah, yeah, still infected. Survived the full moon in werewolf form. Abby, alive? Made it to the safety of Chris Hackett's surveillance room. Caitlin, infected. Caitlin survived the full moon, but remains infected with the werewolf curse. Caleb still infected. Having survived another full moon, Caleb Haggett returned to his human form. So, okay, hang on. But why did it? Why didn't it say that Abby was infected? She got bit. We were all there. We all saw it. She got bit. The white wolf alive. Oh, as the sun rises, the white wolf slinks back to the safety of the woods, waiting for the full moon to come again. We don't even- they doesn't- they don't even get like a name, Silas. It's just the white wolf. So, I'm a little... Well, first of all, we didn't get to see Caitlyn transform. What was that all about? Bad journalism? Murder mystery? Okay, yeah, I'm not- I'm not watching this, sorry. Or listening to this, whatever. Um... So I thought I turned them all into werewolves. I got- wait, I got an achievement. Let me look at it real quick. It was like called Blood Pact or something. I assume that was like, turning everyone into werewolves. Yeah, Blood Pack. Which only 0.2% of players have, by the way. 0.2%. Blood Pact. Infected every character. So Abby was infected, it just didn't say that at the end for some reason. God, this- this game has gotta be horrible to achievement hunt for. I've only got 70% of the achievements. All right, well, that was fun. You know what? I think that was more fun than just killing everyone. Because, as we saw with Emma, um, a couple of the deaths just aren't very satisfying. Like, I thought they were all gonna be like the one with Abby, where she gets her head ripped out and thrown on the ground, Ashley style from Until Dawn, you know? And that's, uh, that's not the case. One of them, Emma was like disemboweled, and the other one, she was just like eaten in the background while the camera zoomed out. I'm assuming there's a lot of deaths like that. Um, I did really, like my favorite part was the Hackett Massacre by Chris. I am disappointed that I couldn't have um, Ryan and Laura both live. I think it was because I stabbed Bobby and he was weaker and so Chris killed him and then Chris killed everyone. But then like, I don't know how I would get Laura to survive. Like I think Travis could have shot her 
maybe if we had made different decisions when his parents were goading him on. But I don't know if there's any way that he doesn't kill Laura with the shard of glass. Yeah, I don't know. Something to think about, I guess. But with that said, I don't. I'm not gonna play this again. I'm satisfied with the experience um, overall. I still think the ending is pretty crap, but it was more fun making them all turn into werewolves than saving them all just for a little slideshow at the end. One thing that I didn't say in the last video was that if you've been a fan of this channel for like a long time, you know I've been wanting a werewolf horror game for like. I've been clamoring for it for like, I don't know, eight years or something. I've been like, is this finally the werewolf horror game? Is this finally the werewolf horror game? I did not know that this was going to be a werewolf horror game until I got really far into it. Uh, you know, there, there's a couple of like slightly werewolfy games I've played, like Don't Escape, for example, um, which is like a 20 minute flash game. Uh, very well designed, but still, you know. Uh, and I would say this is not it. You know, I don't- I, I like the werewolf designs in this one. I like the monster designs in this one, but calling them werewolves is kind of... They, they they're not like conventional werewolves. They're not furry. They're not like... They're not totally beast. For some reason, they're like they're, they're like these fleshy, wendigo-like monsters. Um, and their transformation isn't like a typical werewolf transformation like you see in like, uh, was it the Howling or... Uh, oh, what's the one? Yeah, one of those. Um, American Werewolf in Paris. Uh, where like, you know, the bones crack and their like, arms extend and it's like a slow, like, their jaw comes out. Stuff like that. I was kind of expecting that. I really actually like the transformation of this one, but it's just not werewolf-like. You know, where they just shed the skin and then they're there. It was very shocking. I think my favorite scene in the game is when Nick transforms and just kills Abby. Because it happens so fast, and uh, it's just very shocking and interesting. I think I think that's like the highlight of the game. It's like the game kind of peaks there, and then it's... I wouldn't say it, it it's, it's a very steep decline after that, but it does go downhill after that. Uh, I do I do like some of the later chapters, like 8 and 9, where you're... Um, it's basically like you versus the Hackett's. Uh, like I said before, a lot of my complaints from the last video still remain. I think the ending's crap. I think a lot of the pads that they take you on go nowhere. There's a lot of things like why even, we take the rotor arm out or we cut the fuel line and then Caitlin goes and gets the spare, but then we don't even use it. It begs the question like, what is the scrapyard segment even for? We go to get the thing to repair the car, but then we don't repair the car. Nobody finds out about that Jacob's one sabotaged it. No one like, like in the last, uh, like in this one, he just transforms alone in the woods. In the in the last uh, playthrough, he was just sobbing in the woods, and that's his ending. What? I know there's a lot of different endings that you can get with for these characters, but it just feels like there has there has to be some kind of wrap up. So you know, whatever. I'm not gonna just say and repeat myself over and over and over again like I did in the last video. I already said what I wanted to say, but I am glad that I played it through again. However, I won't be doing it again because this took me five hours and I even skipped the first three chapters. So it would be great. And 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 this is this is one of those things that I I touched on at the end of the last video. This game is remarkably missing in features. It is a game that does not respect your time, it seems, because one thing that I was shocked to find out, um, when I got into the game for the second playthrough, it didn't save my evidence or my clues or my tarot cards. How do you get, I got the high priestess card, but she didn't read it at the end. I just realized that. What's the point of that? Anyway, so if, like, if you want to get all the collectibles, you have to do it all in one run and there's no skips. You can't skip any dialogue. You can't skip any scenes. You just have to play it all the way through and you have to be hyper vigilant and get everything. You have to get every tarot card, you have to get every clue, every evidence. It, it almost doesn't seem possible. Um, but I mean, obviously it is. It just, I don't understand it because like in the dark pictures, can't you skip dialogue? I'm pretty sure you can. 
maybe I'm wrong, but that would be uh, a great feature to have. I know that in the dark pictures, it keeps your collectibles over multiple playthroughs. I don't know why it doesn't in this one. I guess I just have to blame 2K for a lot of this stuff, which I, I don't get. I mean, can we just have, can we just have Bandai Namco take over all of Supermassive games? Because they, they did it right with the dark pictures and everything. I just don't, I don't, the, this one's lacking in a lot of extras and quality of life. But uh, yeah, all right, that's enough out of me. I'll see you guys in the next video. We'll be moving on to something else, but thanks for watching The Quarry. Uh, I'm glad that a lot of you enjoyed it for what it's worth, at least the journey. So, all right, I'll see you all in the next one. Think critically.